discuss about something called dementia. Now some people think that any memory loss, any problem with memory is dementia. And some people think that unless a person becomes completely disabled, till then we don't call it dementia. The reality is that dementia is a spectrum of symptoms where the entire brain starts to get affected, at least more than one lobe. So when we see the frontal lobe getting affected, which is the first part of the brain here, we usually see a personality change. There may be nothing else. People may just say that this person is becoming very rigid in his personality. He is doing some behaviors. He is becoming disinhibited. Typically, we hear of memory loss as the problem with dementia. And that's what we see when the temporal lobe, which is here at the side of your ear, where your temple is there, that's when memory starts to get affected. And not the memory of old things, but the memory of day-to-day -day events. We forget who had called on the telephone. We forget more and more where we have put our things. We can't seem to find the name of everyday thing. For example, you may meet a person who says about a pen, oh you use that to write, uh, what is it, uh, 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 I mean, we use it every day, uh, you carry it in your pocket. So he gives a lot of clues but he is unable to remember that that thing is called a pen. Symptoms like these, memory loss, difficulty in finding words, change in personality or any change in behavior is something which should prompt family members to go check with either a psychiatrist or a neurologist to find out if their family member suffers from dementia or not. Fortunately, even before CT scans or MRIs can pick up whether you have dementia or not, because they will pick up when it is very advanced, we have neuropsychological tests and checklists and questionnaires which very clearly tell us what type of dementia, which part of the brain is getting affected, what functions are getting affected and this can help us very well in what is called neuropsychological 